I love making omelets. It's just eggs and whatever you want to add to them. Sometimes I like making my egg dishes simple, and sometimes I like adding ham and cheese, or broccoli, or peppers. And sometimes, when we're somewhere out west, like in New Mexico, I like making huevos rancheros for brunch. Eggs are a very good source of protein, and it's important for growing kids to eat enough protein so that they can grow healthy and strong. Eggs don't cost much, and they're available everywhere. A dozen eggs feed plenty, and there are lots of different dishes you can make with them. So I've got a question for you. Which came first, the chicken or the egg? It's going to be an excellent day. Josh and I are going to show you two different ways you can cook an egg, starting with the classic French rolled omelet, which Josh is going to make because it's slightly difficult, and if you can make it, I consider you an expert. We're using organic brown eggs. <clears throat> today, so just give it a little tap on a hard surface into your bowl. Typically I use two eggs per omelet. A few little important tips to remember when cooking omelets. Try using a nonstick pan, that'll give you the least trouble in cooking an omelet. Keep everything you need right here, your mise en place, remember that? Yeah. <laughs> I try always using a rubber spatula because you don't want to scrape the Teflon on the nonstick pan. And Generally, you're supposed to use clarified butter for a French omelet, but I prefer to use oil. It's a little healthier. So we're going to drizzle a little oil here and get that hot. You always want your pan on high heat, so that'll set the egg yolk and the egg proteins quicker. Okay? So what is your favorite omelet to eat, Abby? I have a lot of favorites. I like to eat the omelet with cheese and spinach and onions, with peppers. Excellent. Do you cook them for your parents? Yes, I have. And family? Good. They enjoy them. <laughs> I bet they do. Okay. So get this a little hotter. Alright, so now, when you put your egg in, you want to constantly give it stirring quick motions because okay. you want the egg to set as quick as possible. Because in a French omelet, you don't want color. So, just get in here with the egg. Keep it stirring. Scrape the sides down when you need to. Okay. And I'll show you when it gets to a certain point, that's when you want to add your salt and pepper. Okay. So see how it's starting to get all clumpy here? So here we'll just add a little salt, a little black pepper, stir it around, and then start smoothing it out, okay? Okay. And start forming that circle. Okay. Push the uncooked egg to the side. Make sure it's loose here. Now we're going to flip it like that. Now this is where we start rolling it. So take your spatula, tip your pan a little forward, and then roll it once, and then slide it down, and roll it a second time. Now that's going to seal the seam, so you shouldn't be able to see it too well. Thank you. And there you go. So are we ready to make an American omelet? Yes, we are. All right. Get two more eggs, okay. okay? Just like we did with the French omelet. Crack them. Okay. And you have chosen to have peppers, onions, and tomatoes in it. Yes. Excellent. Which we have right here. Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> so let's mix those up just like we did before. But at the same time, we're also going to saute our vegetables because you can't put raw onions and peppers in there because that won't be too pleasant. <laughs> okay. And the peppers. Okay, here we go. And then I like to put just a little salt on them to seat them. So you can just keep stirring those around okay. and we'll get started on the omelet. So we're going to start this omelet the same way as we did with the French. Get it at nice high heat. I should keep stirring. Yep. Okay, and then we're going to pour them in. Scrape your bowl out. And again, keep the eggs moving. Now the difference with the American omelet and the French omelet is the fold. American omelet, you just fold it once and a half. 
and you stuff the other vegetables inside it. Like a taco. Okay, a little seasoning. At this point, you have to flip again. And the American omelet doesn't necessarily have to be colorless, right? No, this one doesn't have to be colorless. <laughs> okay. Here, let's add our tomatoes. How are your vegetables ready? Um, are they ready? Good. Okay. Just <laughs> a few of those in. Now here you can add cheese too if you want. Okay. And then all we do is simply fold it in half. Let that seal a little. And a plate. Yum! Then we have American style omelet. So, Abby, well, let's dig in and try them. Awesome. Bon mm. Really good. Excellent. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs>